Okay, so, uh, I think we're ready to go. Uh, we should save up a bit for the um, armor achievements later on, but for now, I think we're good. Uh, let's just reset our skills again. Uh, I'm gonna use this in a second. Once we're out on the field, uh, we're at the base right now, so well, let's see. Inventory. Uh, so we're gonna sell a few things. Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna sell this. We have this now, which we upgraded. Um, so, yeah. Um, fence, chase and block, fence, chase and block, yep. Alright, so now we have some better gear. Um, the only other thing I think I'd like to upgrade is the uh, chest plate. But I'm thinking of getting something that's already somewhat enchanted first off, then maybe enchanting it a little bit later. But, um, I want to save money for now, because, um, uh, we want some more potions. And, uh, yeah, so we need a few more attack and defense. Okay. Attack, defense. Alright, um, I could probably use two or four of these, actually. Um, I'll go with four, you know what, I'll, I'll do that. Okay. And, I don't know if I want to use attack right away. Actually, we're having a boss fight, so we'll just hold on to a few of these. They're nice to add, like, uh, for dealing with the poison enemies. Um, maybe I might not use them to go save real quick. And how many potions do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, let's make like two more potions to our Lars Rejuvenation, I think. So that would be about four medium healing, four medium mana. Which I don't normally only buy this much, but I usually buy a lot more potions. But Once we get through this boss fight, we go to the next area. Because um, I don't want to be doing this forever, so. Not rushing or anything. I didn't make sure to level up a couple times higher than the max level for enemies I'm fighting, right? So I think. Uh, yeah, I think we're good. Uh, okay. Yep. I'm going to save real quick. And. Let's open up the map. We should be on our way. So we need to make sure to quickly be fully light. Healing. Sir. Okay. And we are causing poison damage now with the axe. And it's a pretty good axe. Pretty good. Um, I don't know how much better the other one. I think a decent amount. Alright. There we go. Yeah, it's pretty good. Okay, um, so that's the boss fight, so we will go there in a second. We'll also get the uh, speed boost in a minute. Okay, so we do need to switch out our skills in a second, but um, kind of dealing with goblins right now, so I don't really know. Ah, no. Okay, um, skills, so I used Holy Light recently, let's switch that up with the, uh, speed boost, which we're using, okay, may as well get rid of these goblins while I'm here, alright, some more crystals, we do need some more crystals, um, alright, and I believe we're ready to go, so let's do this. Alright, 
Alright, what are we up against? Oh, a lot of enemies actually. Okay. Let's go ahead and get rid of them. So it looks like we already finished it. Wow, we caused a lot of damage. So uh, let's see what we got. An old pattern of an old scroll. Okay. Post finished, return to the village. Yeah, I guess we should go ahead and return now. Um, Alright, so we can go a long way, all the way back, or uh, we could just use a portal scroll, which we do have. Okay, I'm just kind of worried for a second. Constitution, okay. Uh, Alright. So now we're back home, and uh, let's go save real quick, and uh, let me make sure uh, uh, everything's good. Yep, yep, I'm still recording. Uh, Alright. <clears throat> uh, right, so the quest. Ah, yeah, it's the scroll. Great, let me see. Um, it was written in Sakara language. The old language has been lost for a very long time. It's rare to find people in this language who can read it. So our only clue is in the cypherable. This is not the way things should be going. Hmm. Zach, Zach can read the scroll. Uh, but who else can read it? Let me see. Alright, quest complete. And over the next quest. My heart began to calm down after the troops were laid to rest. Thank you, I need to recover my body and be positive. I hope I can give you more help with your investigation, provide you with clues. Oh yes, Susan's eyes are by now, aren't they? She is from another land, and she knows many languages. She can read this. Can you take the scroll of Susan and see if she can help? Alright, we've accepted the quest. Thanks, come back when you have more news. Um... And I guess we'll throw away some of our crystals since we're here. Uh... Okay. Uh, so now let's do the next quest. Okay. Alright, what can I do for you? Yes, old language, let me see. It should be a language called Sakura, which was lost for hundreds of years. Back in my land, there was a similar language which I could try to translate it. The Dungeon Seal Entrance Village Stella Giant Key. It says something like, The dungeon which the Devil of Abyss has been sealed is inside Arco's Village. The entrance key is guarded by the Double Headed Giant. It sounds like this won't be a simple job. A new challenge is waiting for you. Hurry up and go tell us the call. Alright, so now we have to go tell the call. I forgot who's the call. Probably the person who just talked to you or something, but... Or someone else. Oh, oh, okay. Really, I got it. Amazing news. The dungeon where a devil of abyss was sealed and is actually inside this village. It seems the only thing to do is to defeat the double-headed giant 
get back the key and defend the entrance of the dungeon well. So it can't be opened easily and evil won't come back to this land. But I recall that but whenever I recall the horror of a double party giant that makes me shudder, the whole team was wiped out by him in a flash. But you made it beat him as you have proved me a capable warrior. When I was escaping from that tough battle, I used my last breath to seal the entrance of the valley where the double headed giant lives. That seal can only be released by a special stone called Nirvana. This stone is very rare and can only be found in the abandoned mine in the south, but there will be some hard fight waiting for you. As under surface, the double headed giant must be searching for Nirvana as well. If they find a stone first, I don't even want to think about the consequences. Are you ready to go? Well, we did just get our, um, suit and stuff upgraded, like just the, uh, weapon and shield, but yeah, yeah. Okay, great, leave as quickly as you can. You can find our banner and the abandoned mine in the south. Take care. Alright, so now, this is the, um, this is probably the second to last quest. So you need to get the stones and want the key to go to the, uh, final boss. So yeah, you just need to get the stone from the mine to do that, so. Uh, let's look around, uh, for anything, if we miss anything, I doubt we did, but, uh, quest, yes, I know, there's a quest I'm doing, so, made in mind, so, right now, alright, um, looking around for stuff, I guess we should go there next, um, so, uh, yeah, uh, just go through all the quests real quick, so we're check marked. Yep, okay, perfect, save. So, um, now we finished up that, we can do the next one. We have, um, uh, I think we have a good amount of potions to start with for now. We can buy some more later. We're gonna sell some of these, um, things like the boots and that bracelet, though. Alright, so. There we go. Um, uh, got one scroll, that's okay, um, we usually get a whole bunch of them in the inventory. So, um, so if you take a look at the, um, the quest, <coughs> find the stone of Urbana and the abandoned mine in the south. So, uh, it looks like we've got two places left to go, so yeah, these are, um, abandoned mine, and the last level, that's the boss fight, see the, the little monster over there? Mm -hmm. Yep, okay, so, uh, abandoned mine is here, so, uh, uh, we basically will be here, and then we're going to go to South Mine, Silent Hill, Silent Forest, and then Abandoned Mine. So, South Mountain, Silent Hill, Silent Forest. Okay, well, let's go. Okay. Yeah, that's not good. 
Okay. When in doubt, use one of the special abilities. Okay. Um. Uh, it's not really. Okay, hang on. There's not a whole lot of enemies to level up yet, but that's okay. Alright. Uh, I'll probably level up again though while we're here, I don't think about it. Should be enough. I'm probably already already, like right now, but just want to make sure. Uh, 
need to uh, rebuff this second healing potion. And then the speed over here. Alright, okay. Um, let's keep going. Okay, this is bad. Okay. Just need to stay away from most of those enemies for now. Why am I so paranoid? Well, they only lightning damage and uh support as well they're not really just the hell. So it's kinda of dangerous. Oh, I 
this way, there's speedfist. Okay. 
sensor over there. Okay. Uh, 
something good. Yep, okay, perfect. Just checking something. Okay. Uh, okay, I'll look up. I'm keeping this. This gets to a lot. Eight to nine. Um, final boss fight. It's a series of different levels for the final boss fight. Uh, for different, like, areas to go in to get there. Uh, it's like, yeah, so lots of powerful enemies. This 33, 38, 37, 37. Alright. So we're gonna just sell some of these things. Uh, ooh. 75, 73. Um, no. 75, okay. Um, okay. So, we have, uh, a couple potions, crystal or two. Um, a couple crystals, yeah, quite a bit. That's good. We put away the crystals. Um, Oh yeah, we did it because do we have to turn it in? I think this might be where we turn it. You found Ravana, great, only one more step to victory. Alright, quest complete. Um, we're at level 32, we're almost there. 